I didn't know I was getting this tonight, but um, thank you very much. And I would just like to say I was a broken woman when I started kickboxing. Um, it was suggested to me and it was the best thing I ever did because it and uh, the Winspers family, Matt and James, his mom and dad, uh, saved me. So thank you very much. After 10 years, Bob, of being in here, the last award to give out, and it's well deserving, as we know, Mr. Matt Winsper. So, uh, I'll, I'll talk, I'll talk. <laughs> the kids, they're, they're fed up, they've waited all night. Is, I said you were last just to wind them up, not because you're best here. But years ago, what you did on the circuit, you know, you just you just exploded onto the scene. I called you new boy on the block. I'm mean, a new kid on the block, isn't it? I said, old kid, right? Yeah, you are now, but uh, the thing is, what you did was quite, it was quite, you hit with quite an impact when you just turned up. You didn't just turn up, you just turned up into the seniors from the kids' divisions and beat everybody. You destroyed them. Yeah? And that was just a great moment. Billy Bryce, Mark Brown, etc., etc. You just terrorised them. They just didn't like you. But anyway, I'll let you have a little word on the mic. Thank you, Bob. So, uh, first of all, obviously, a, a big round of applause for uh, Bob and for Paul themselves. I've known both of these gentlemen for decades, and they are pioneers and gentlemen in the martial arts and deserve all the accolades they get. Uh, they're both wonderful people, although Bob hasn't been so great for my self-esteem over the years. I can remember once he, he uh, put me on the cover of MAI, which I thought was fantastic. I was really proud to do that. And then a few weeks later, he phoned me up and said, Matt, I'm ever so sorry, but that's the lowest selling copy of MAI we've ever had. <laughs> I still don't know if that's true or not, but uh, it is true. OK, thanks, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> but that's Bob's sense of humour, so, uh, <laughs> but thank you very much, uh, it's not true really, okay, there was one more lower selling, was it? Bill Wallace was lower, okay, that, that makes me feel better. Uh, so, yeah, just a few, a few thank yous, um, first of all to uh, my beautiful family out there, uh, Claire sat over there, my stepson Ackland, give us a wave Ackland, there we go. And to my daughter Eliza. Give us a wave, Eliza. So anybody who would remember me as a fresh-faced 10, 11, 12-year-olds on the karate circuits, that's the spinning image of me, would you say, Bob? Yeah, it looks just like me. 
They hate it. <laughs> um, also, a wonderful thank you to my, my club, Winterpers Martial Arts, who are sat on table 10. Big round of applause for those guys. Thank you all. As we all know here, we're all in love with the martial arts and life has a way of giving us a kick every now and then and pulling us down. And we all know that martial arts can bring us back up and these guys on this table are uh, instrumental in that. Anytime I feel low, a lovely message off these guys will bring me back up and make me feel better. We've heard lots of inspirational, fantastic stories on here, way more inspirational than mine. Um, but we're all joined and we're all uh, linked by one thing and that's our love of martial arts which makes us all family in here together so god bless you all thank you matt thank you sir we'll do a picture before you go but, but listen i know we've all got to get on and i could say some sort of profound words at the end but you know i think after what's been said tonight they'll just not even match up to them so again thank you to everybody and we do make a difference. <laughs> Give us a wave, everyone.